I'm gonna do a range test on my 3DR Solo and I uh, wanna see how far I can get out of these stock antennas. And uh, then I also wanna try these uh, nine DBI antennas that I bought. Got them online for about 10 bucks. Uh, see if they give me some extra range. They're pretty big, noticeably bigger than the stock ones. And uh, I've been seeing uh, I've been seeing some stuff on YouTube and uh, on the internet about uh, the soda can antenna. So I'm gonna take a soda can and somehow mount it to my stock antenna and uh, let's see if it does anything. So, all right, let's try this out. I got 4,035 feet. That's almost a thousand feet more than the stock antennas. So that's not bad for, for like 10 bucks. But, all right, this looks a little ridiculous, but um, I have my soda cans set up here. Let me uh, give you a closer shot here so you can see. And I took um, like, a, like a heat duct tape because it's a metal foil. So I also attached the antenna to the can with this metal foil tape. So uh, we'll see what this does. Uh, this looks kind of crazy, but. That didn't go very far. Um, I got 1,440 feet out of my cans. So uh, I don't know if taping over them had some kind of effect on the signal. If it, uh, if it actually kind of blocked the signal instead of uh, let the signal come in. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, I only got 1,440 feet. So uh, I think I'm gonna stick to my nine DBI antennas until I uh, upgrade and uh, then I'm going to test out the, the spherical antenna 
uh, I think it's the FVPLR or FPVLR, one of those two. But uh, I plan on getting one of them, and as soon as I do, I'm going to test the range out on that and see how far I can get with that. But for now, it's the 9DBI that is the winner.